For Peyton Manning, the opening chapter of his NFL career was awe-inspiring. Rolls on over the middle, got it! Touchdown! Another touchdown! Peyton is shredding this team. And he was knocking on the doorstep of greatness. On September 30th, 2001, Manning would have a date with Bill Belichick and the New England Patriots. Greatness would be put on hold. The Patriots and Colts this afternoon, and certainly a difficult task for the Patriots to try to come up with their first win of the season. Even though the situation was what it was, I think defensively we were very confident because we had their number. Peyton with the reception, and he is leveled. I just recall it being a pretty physical game, especially by our defense. Brian Cox laid Jerome Payton out on a little under route they ran to start the game. The final score from New England. Patriots 44, Colts 13. It was a tough day. I don't think it was all Peyton's fault. When you're 0 4 in a takeaway giveaway ratio, you turn the ball over four times. I mean, two of them for touchdowns. Holy mackerel. That's not efficient football. You got to be able to make some plays and you got to be able to complete some passes. And we just didn't execute very well. That's how you get beat. For Manning, the frustration of week three, 2001, would become agonizingly familiar. However, Manning would use those losses to drive him, eventually past Belichick and the Patriots, to the greatness he was destined for.